leg day. Uh, before we get into that, I wanted to talk a little bit about supplementation and what we normally do. So uh, we always consume uh, about 300 milligrams of caffeine in a stem pre-workout. Uh, lately, I've been using uh, pre-gym, pre-JYM. Uh, I like their products a lot, not just because of taste, but also because I take creatine uh, hydrochloride, which I know most people do not, simply because it's like four times the price per ounce compared to uh, creatine monohydrate. But also research doesn't, there's not a lot of research to uh, suggest that hydrochloride uh, offers a, a market advantage over monohydrate. However, um, for me, like gastrointestinally, it goes down easier and I have no problems uh, taking it down versus in the past I have had problems on monohydrate. So uh, we're sticking to hydrochloride for now. Um, I also add some Himalayan pink salt Oh, uh, for simply for electrolytes. I, I add like, I have a little grinder at home and I, I probably add like 500, 600 milligrams of it to each of my pre-workouts. And then I brought the grinder with me this time too so I can add it to my post-workout. Uh, simply because it's a much cheaper alternative to buying an electrolyte drink like Gatorade or, or Powerade. So other than that, uh, here is the schedule for today. Uh, next, you'll see us at the rec center. You all are gonna like this gym a lot. If you haven't been before, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the gym. Pre-pump check. Also, never been in this room before. Like, take a look around this room. This is a dance studio hidden in the corner of the rec center, so. Yeah, pretty nice. No shoes allowed, I'm lucky. Here, look at it from the mirror, the mirror perspective. Yeah, my leg has been growing a little bit. I'm really lucky because like, when I start accumulating a decent amount of body fat, I get it first in my, my thighs before I get it in my belly and my neck, so. Hmm. But, dude, I am still hella lean. But, Primarily, the thing we're looking for primarily here in this pre pump check is we'll, we'll use this as a, a comparison tool for before and after to see if we really achieved a significant pump from today's leg session. Yeah, and then right here, I'm super freaking lean. And you, Henry, are Asian, so. Whoa. All right, so next uh, incline walk. So we'll see y'all in the gym. This is all skill, skill.
So, change of plan from the usual. Normally we do, uh, for our third exercise or movement, we would do a compound squat, but uh, like a hypertrophy set, somewhere between the 8 to 15 rep range. However, today I'm feeling a little spicy, so we're going to do our, our first set's gonna be a heavy double, I think. Despite having done my calves and hamstrings beforehand, my legs feel extremely pumped and really good, so we're gonna attempt something heavy. So, I PR'd 335 on squat back in December. But uh, on that PR, it was, uh, it, the bar moved way too easily. But I was too zapped already to increase the weight uh, to go up more. So, this time I attempted my PR for two. Pretty smooth. I felt like the second round wasn't deep enough, but like I reviewed the footage and it looks, looks okay. I, if, Next time we do that, we'll definitely get a side view so we can uh, gauge the depth better. But uh, next exercise, uh, we're going to do another quad exercise to top it off our legs. Bulgarian split squat. This is the one and only time you'll ever see us do this. So uh, take notes. Yeah, torture. This is what we do for our viewers. Tell me what's the point if I lose myself? Spend a couple days with nobody else Holding in my breath just to see if I can find you in my dreams Oh, I'm getting tired of losing faith In everything I see The beauty in the stars above The last day holds up me That concludes our leg day. Unfortunately, no pose down today. So, mm -hmm. uh, dancing studio was taken. There's no other rooms. And then, typically when we work out in the university gyms, we just do a pose down in the bathroom. But we're not gonna film in the bathroom. So, <laughs> honestly, with the camera quality that we're operating on, you can't see a significant difference oh God. in the pump. You can't you can't see our pump that well. So uh, honestly, only way we could display a significant difference is probably bringing the measuring tape and then 
participate in the circumference of our, our thighs. Shake the hamstring quad pump. So, uh, the move now is uh, food. I think we're going to Coco's, right, Henry? Mm hmm. Right. So, Coco's. Coco's. It's been a hot second since we've been there. Go. It's going to be meal three for me, and then uh, <laughs> it's what, 7 30 right now? So, three hours from now, I'll have my fourth and final meal. Uh, and included somewhere in between that as well, it, there's going to be a protein shake. So, yeah. right now, as far as protein consumption, I am doing about 1.2 grams of protein per pound of body weight, which on a bulk, scientifically speaking, you should be shooting for 0.6 grams to 0.8 grams per pound of body weight. However, I read a recent study that was published showing that there's no upper tolerable intake for protein. So it's diminishing gains. However, any small gains is gains. So I will take what I can get. And then I'm just, I, we have the budget to consume as much protein as we want. So we're going to do that. Uh, I'll, that being said though, uh, I've had to invest in baby wipes because of it, so. Wait, what? All right. Uh, <laughs> tomorrow, oh, I got it. rest day. We will not be publishing content day after that. Wednesday, we're going to be hitting chest and tricep. And then I'm gonna show y'all the RLP gym. Uh, so look forward to that. Thanks for watching y'all. If you have any uh, comments or any cr critiques, then uh, please leave it in the comment section or DM me again. And uh, please let us know how you liked the edits in our last video, which we're including this as well. And uh, pretty soon, I think our next big plan is an intro slash outro, one of the two. And uh, y'all will see that before I even begin to discuss it. So thanks for watching. We'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.